I'm, I'm getting uh, multiple women. Is he a bigamist? Pimp? Does he sell children on the black market? What? Shall we? Let's go somewhere dark. You can give me a history lesson. Come here, sit down. Please, sit. You haunted my boss's house? It was the only way to show him how important and needed you are. Look how brave you've been. It was staticky, but we heard a deep, gravelly voice. Oh, man, he's not even hearing it, much less feeling it. Gus, I think it's clear to the three of us that you're neither hearing it nor feeling it. What I can't discern is, are you mad at it? I know you remember that. Gus, this is so easy. Try making a key. Do you think this pretty much ruins my chances with Katarina? The jackal has arrived. Ber ba ben Berklin's Berenson's brand. Yeah, but you no longer have a date. Jesse! <laughs> you gotta work the room. I'm a worker from the outside. You're gonna work it from in here. Now shut the door. I'm all cramped. Well, get up, man. Do some push-ups or something. I need you light and limber. Do some push-ups. How was I to know he's an avid scuba diver when he heard that I gave lessons in Cozumel that summer? Jim. For four years, he's been Dr. Sloan to me, and in one afternoon, he's Jim? Jason, if you've got to resort to hiring this idiot psychic and his little sidekick... I'm nobody's psychic. Step a step back. Who lives here? The Borringtons? There's a better than decent chance this goes poorly. You know, it was actually Gus's asthma medication that first interested him in pharmaceuticals. We have no phones. I told you to charge that phone. You did not. I didn't? Just thinking it counted. Go ahead and put your aluminum foil hat back on. I'm not paranoid, Sean. It happens. Anyway, I believe this is a department record for the fastest bust ever in a case this size. Introduction of microprinting as an anti-replicant feature began in 1990 with the addition of the words the United States of America, printed around Ben Franklin's lapel. What I'm trying to say is it was murder she wrote, not murder they wrote. It's true. Oh, this is great. In fact, I was actually hoping to discuss I'm glad the possibility. You understand. Fuller refused to sell his house after all these years. Dollars. Driving back, I nearly drove off the road. Hello, my name is Lenny. I like to... You think you'd open up if we knocked again? I'm gonna need your license and regis. Oh, hey. Oops, I, I, I didn't know it was you guys. Sorry, but in this car you just happen to fit a profile. I'm a man of untold mysteries. If you found out... Yes. Did you also happen to mention to my son that during these jaunts, the community here filled out a missing persons report? Are you busy on Saturday? You, you want me to come with you to awkward class? Yeah, forget it. See ya. Dude, I'm so sorry. I didn't realize I've had the keys all along. You tracked me? Yes, I did, with a little help from my friends at your wireless service provider. By the way, they might be calling, they think you're a fugitive. Gus, <clears throat> isn't there something you wanted to say to Jimmy here? What are the gardenias? I've had them longer than you've been alive. <laughs> Don't ever, under any circumstances, ever admit that to anyone outside of these walls. Secondly, I love utilizing your knowledge, Gus. I can't wait until we have the case of the missing thimble. But this can... <laughs> Sean? What the hell are you doing here? He completely revamped our inventory system. Really? Whole system from A to Z? Including M? Killed someone here at our high school reunion. Just to foil your 13-year video retrospective of best pep rally moments. It's gonna be a problem, though. Why? Because we've already got a meeting with the dead guy's widow. When? Ten minutes. Ten minutes? Look, don't worry. I'm gonna do it in the chief's office. Just need you to stand guard at the door, make sure no one catches us in there. Don't make a move! Drop the fish, sir, and nobody gets hurt. <sighs> You think you could sign this check for us? We're a little bit brokish. You think she went back inside to get a pen? Face it, Spencer. You'd have a chance of finding that down plan before we do. But, uh, 
Have a nice walk. Let's go. <laughs> yeah, well, your people have a much more affectionate memory of this period of history than my people do. What are you talking about? We saw Posse together in theaters. <sighs> well, you know how it is. Do the bunk bed thing. Make some lanyards. Catch a fish. Go home early because some repairman got electrocuted in the swimming pool and the camp closed. Customize. Match the gift with the individual. Look. Jules, that's how it goes when you're partners. I can only count the number of times that Gus has left my cheese in the wind. What? Nothing. Study on, buddy. Arterial sclerosis. Rosacea. Hand it over. Dad, how did you get in here? The unlatched window, the unlocked back door, maybe this key that I made. You choose one. What do you want? Get that for you. I know exactly what that means. Sean, what is the sentence for assaulting a police officer? Oh, it's OK, buddy. <laughs> Sorry, I guess he's a little overprotective of his older sister. Well, welcome, welcome to the Fortress of Solitude. Coffee? Oh, no, no, thank you. No, I've had enough. <laughs> no more coffee. Dude, I gave you two full warnings. My underwear is soaked. Just like old times. Just mine. Yes. One of those buildings is going to be teamwork isn't the worst thing. Psychically, I could sense that there was information in that office that we needed, so uh, we'll go check with the cops while you scope those out. Carpal tunnel. Hey. Uh, we need to get close to the team. Are you saying we go undercover? I'm saying we assume alternate identities so that we can get in there and investigate without drawing any extra attention to ourselves. This is my underprivileged mentee, holla back at you. He's selling magazine subscriptions as a way to learn business skills. Otherwise, he'd be forced to join a gang if he was still on the streets. If I were still out on the street, <laughs> I'd be an OG. <laughs> you wish. On Tuesdays, I go out and get new games. Maybe throw in a trip to 7-Eleven for a grape slurpee. Let's see what's at 1313 Mockingbird Lane. That's the Munster's house. It was 1600 Joshua Lane. Thanks, note to self. Mina's gone. What? You didn't kill her, did you? Gus, please, some decorum. You didn't, right? No! I put her on a plane and broke it off with her. Maybe I was just meant to be alone. Finnegan! What are best friends of mysteriously estranged old college pals for? <laughs> Simple mission statement for my venture is to create the perfect juicy wiener and the perfect icy surface to enjoy said wiener on. Now, to be completely frank with you, no, no pun intended. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Oh, you guys. This is so nice. This feels good. I knew you were special from the beginning, you. You had me. Did you see the sunrise part, too? Mr. Seaver is a great American. Who worked for a criminal? And now his life may be in grave danger. We'd like to ask you a question about one Scott Seaver. You mean now that he's out of witness protection? You knew that? You just confirmed it for me. I can't catch a break this week, can I? We've been together before, when we were three. It's essentially the same thing, it's just impolite to pee. That feels great, by the way. Sean. I knew you'd come. Are you wearing Haversham's robe? Yeah. You should try it. The worm that spins this silk is extinct. You can't find these. Take it off. Boom, boom, boom. Muffins. That's incredible. Thanks, I made it up just now. I was talking about the detective thing. We remember Shabby, don't we? Shabby, the sea lion. Well, I tracked him at sea.